Okay, so tomorrow, today's Sunday, tomorrow we have our engagement photos. So today is prep day. We're washing my hair tomorrow. I'm gonna do some skin stuff um, tonight. But right now, actually, I'm stopping by um, our favorite florist in LA, the boy who cried flowers. He does all the flower arrangements for basically anything that like a Valentine's Day or like special occasion that Brian orders. He did our um, engagement flowers. Tomorrow, he's going to do a small little bouquet for me but he's going to do some, uh, I guess it would be like flower collars for the dogs, because we want the dogs to be in, in the photos, some of them. So I'm dropping off some collars for him, and um, should be so cute. The boys got groomed today as well, not groomed, they got a bath and Lukey got his hair brushed out. Um, so they are all prepped for the shoot as well. Um, but yeah, today's just prepping. Let me see you fluffy. Let me see you fluffy. Good boy, good boy. So if you watched my what I ate in a day video, here's my avocado toast with everything bagel seasoning. Makeup is coming for me in two hours, but I'm gonna wait and let my hair air dry and kind of see what it looks like and then figure out what I wanna, how I wanna style my hair for the shoot. But I took the weekend off, I didn't do any work. Now it's biting me in the ass because I have to like try and edit a video as much as I can before people start coming here today. So I shall be doing this. Um, but yeah, it's gonna be busy cleaned up a little because there's gonna be a few people in the house So yeah, the boys are resting. They have no idea what's about to happen to them But I'm excited it should be fun This one's mine, it has the anchovies. Looks good. We're still waiting for our photos, but we did get our um, minted, I guess, samples for our save the dates. Because if you remember, um, we're only gonna do save the dates for kind of like the elders that might not know how to use you know, a website or need just information that they can paste or like put on their refrigerator or something like that. So we're not gonna order too many, but um, this is actually pretty cool. They have everything in this cute little box for you. This is not sponsored. This video is not sponsored by the way, but I just wanna show you what can you expect? Cause what to expect? Cause this is actually very cute. So this is kind of just a pamphlet of kind of things that you can 
expect at the price range that you are looking into. And then this is the really cool thing. They give you samples of different choices that you can make on your um, save the dates and then also I assume your invitations as well. So here are kind of the different types of papers that one can use. Oh yeah, this is actually very helpful because you can only assume like what this stuff looks and feels like. So this is obviously much thicker than normal. Oh, this <laughs> Lux Museum board is actually pretty intense. I don't know why you would need something like this, but this is pretty intense. But we are going to use obviously premium 100 recycled paper. It actually feels like much smoother than the other ones. And honestly, it looks the same. <laughs> so, but these are fun too. Um, but we're gonna go with the postcard so we don't actually need envelopes. Just trying to minimize the waste that people might throw away, you know? And then here's foil, but I'm pretty sure if you care about something being recycled, I don't know if it can have this kind of stuff on it, but I'm not 100% sure. So everything all in here in a cute little congrats, you're getting married package. And then here are some of the samples that we actually wanted to see. You can order um, a few samples. I think these might've been like $2 each. So just be aware that you do have to pay. So it really just depends on what your vibe is because obviously the picture doesn't matter. So I think text-wise, I like this one the best. I guess just now we'll, we'll just wait for the photos and see which photos look best with one of these. I like this one though, I really like the font. Okay, so it's been a few. I'm not sure the last time I spoke, spoke to you all, but we have decided upon our, um, first of all, all our photos are very cute, but we have finally decided upon our save the date photo. Dur, 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 dur. There's our save the date photo. So now I am going to go on Minted to build our save the dates. I have such a headache. I have actually not been feeling very well the past couple days. And it's not COVID, but I go like in and out of like what feels like the beginning of a head cold. But today I just have the worst headache, the worst headache. I've taken so many pills, but maybe tea is just what I need or something. I don't know. So again, we're only going to do a small amount of save the dates. I think the least amount that you can buy is 25. So I'm just going to go ahead and do 25. And in the picture, if you remember, there was a lot of like headspace above us. So it would be like save the date blah, 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 up here. We like, or I like the simple modern save the date. The least I can get is 25. Brian likes this picture a lot. I don't really like it. I think it's because he's smiling. But yes, this is our save the date. Oops. And our other photo, let me just give you a sneak peek of the other photos we did. Cute. Hello. I mean, hello. That's the one Brian likes. Hello. So cute. Do we think that this is easy to read or hard to read? I think that might be really hard to read. Yeah, I wonder if that's hard to read. We might have to go with... I think this is hard to read. Might have to go with something thicker. Ugh, that's annoying. Okay. By the way, Brian is at a bachelor party. Not his bachelor party, but a bachelor party. And let me tell you, I'm gonna go into this in a different video, but I am so thankful that I'm doing a solo bachelorette party because this man is so mad at how much money he's spending on someone else's bachelor party. I mean, yes, I do want to spend time with myself. That's like, really, I just want me time. But also because our wedding is already a destination wedding, I'm not trying to put that kind of pressure on my friends to like also do a destination or just like any kind of bachelorette party. It's just, I don't know. It kind of just ends up working for everyone the way I'm doing it, but we'll go more into detail later about that. I am going to 
look through this hmm, and get these done today because five months out and apparently we're already a little behind but once I decide the save the date I think I can then build the website which is what everyone wants so <sighs> things are coming together I feel like I say that every wedding video but things are coming together I have a meeting on Friday with my two wedding planners so yeah I'll see you all next time okay bye